team in an IEBA competition separate generally. But he's looked good. Tall southpaw, good jab. Skachidov, solid looking fighter, quite accurate. He's not spectacular. He's in the red boxing for Germany. Shinburganov of Kazakhstan is in the blue. looking for that jab early on Shinburganov he landed that against Giyasov right from the very very start and just kept landing it and landing it and landing it right hand on the move lad from Shinburganov looking quite aggressive at the start of the fight here Skanshidov Trying to see if he could dip to his left there and deliver that left to the body. Good job. Richard Berkinov. Skatchidov is doing pretty well here early on. Right hand gets through there from the German. There's some damage to the left eye there. Taken over to see the doctor. Punch, says the referee. So if the fight gets stopped due to that cut, which is not going to at the moment, but, but if it does, then that will be a win for Schimburgenov. by RSC I right hand on the inside there from from Skatchidov was answered back by Shimburganov but then another one came back from the German this is heating up midway through the round both of them landing some good good blows there's that jab right hand as well from Shimburganov and he's just trying to walk through a few of these Skatchidov I don't think that cuts too bad I don't think I hope anyway that's not really going to have any bearing on anything Good accurate work though from Shimburganov. When he locks on, you do have a problem because he's got quick hands and as he showed against Gyasov, as he showed on countless other occasions, he, he has got accurate hands too. Little up jab there from Shimburganov and then crashes the right hand down the centre. There's that jab. Just lent in behind the right hand a touch. Jab again there, Shinburganov. Just got caught by a right hand as he tried to pull out there. He's had the better of this opening round though. Skatchidov had a good first half of it. Second half, since he went over to see the doctor about the cut really, hasn't been quite as good. I don't think it's a problem with the vision or anything like that because I do think that the blood is running clear of the eye, but it just seemed to disrupt him a bit. line across the board there for Shimburganov. There's the jab. Is that the right hand that maybe caused the cut? The referee said it was definitely caused by a punch. Well, it's already happened by that stage. He's got that kind of raking right cross. Big long arms. Jolting. Action of the head as it landed there.
first one too almost there from Shibuganov. Led off with the right hand and then followed it through with the jab. That right and that left, they kind of operate on a on a pulley system. One lands, it pulls the other one through, and vice versa. It's a nice smooth, easy action. He's never loading up on anything, he just lets his hands go. Right hand lands again there from Schimburg. And Oskatchinov is just trying to walk him down and get onto the inside, but it's very difficult because he's just getting hit too much it's a very basic observation but that's exactly what's happening and he's taking away any kind of momentum or or ability to set up attacks as well as it being physically tiring and in the case of the eye damaging Big light middleweight Shimbergenov as well in the previous weight classes. It was a 69, which might have been difficult for him. A couple more kilos, nearly four and a half pounds to play with. It's it's a lot. Skatidov just keeps coming though. Shibuganov output has dipped though from Shibuganov towards the end of the round here not that surprising that's a nice right hand there because he has been pumping out those hands a lot Skatchinov has made him do that the German fighter is full of full of will here but it's another 10-9 20 points to 18 on all five cards so Kazakh is all but through here. Skatchidov has, has got to find something fairly miraculous, really, here in this final three minutes. But as I say, he's, he's never he's never given up on this at any point. You wouldn't exactly expect that to happen, but he could easily have been discouraged because he's been tagged, cl tagged clean quite a lot. is not too pretty so third and final round Magomed Skachidov of Germany representing Germany originally born in Chechnya in Russia he's in the red Aslanbek Shimbergenov of Kazakhstan is in the blue and he is two rounds to nil up on all five of the cards after another good sharp accurate display so far and unless something really pretty surprising happens in this third and final round he will be going through a couple there he has had success in this fight he's landed on Shimburkinov he's not had it all his own way I would describe this as some kind of one-sided beatdown it's just the round wins for Shimburkinov have been clear 
There's a good right hand from Scatchard up to the side of the head. It's just coming together a little bit on the inside. So Bergenov just pushing Skatchedov off and landing a long right hand. But it's been a physically demanding fight, this. Skatchedov just was never going to let Bergenov experience anything else. Opening out to throw the left hand there, Skatchedov didn't pull the trigger on it and was stuck. His feet were stuck, he was quite open, and Shimbergenov just kind of poked through a left hand. It's the final minute of round three. This has been a good watch as well. They treated to some very good action in Ring B today. This afternoon we had some, some really good fights. Long right hand, and he's in trouble, he's in trouble there, Skatchedov, and the referee just realised in time there, because the legs, the legs just stiffened, and he's protesting Skatchedov, but the referee waves it over, and that is a solid right hand, lined it up, hit him with it, slightly delayed reaction, he was standing up, Stock still and tall there, Skatchedov, and it was only really when he started to try and move his legs, which he didn't for maybe a second, that you saw that there was something wrong because they just weren't reacting. It was like he was on stilts. He had a little stumble and the referee jumped in there nice and quick. So through he goes, and that was that was a good performance again. He beat Gyasov of Uzbekistan comfortably, and then Shachidov brought a good fight. Brought a good fight, but he was second best, and then he got hit by that right hand towards the end of the round there. Let's have a look. Well, hopefully we'll get to see it. It was a good shot. Just teed it up. He kind of measured the distance with his left hand and then really sent it home. And there we go, that was it. It was when he started to try and move that, that he had 